The idea of there being an infinite number of parallel universes is hard to imagine. Not least because it means that everything that can happen will happen, and is also happening right now on another level of the multiverse. But this is just sci-fi fantasy, isn't it? Surely we don't have any scientific basis for such a grandiose concept. Oh, but we do. And just recently we may have found the most compelling evidence yet which finally answers the question, how do we know there are parallel universes? At 3. It Answers Questions The Many Worlds Theory was created in 1954 by Princeton University doctoral candidate Hugh Everett III, who sounds less like a physicist and more like a downtown Abbey villain who would knock up the maid, sully her name, and desecrate the corpse of that unfortunate named dog that died in Season 5. Everett believed that parallel universes exist which have branched off from ours, and our present universe is just another branch within an infinite number of other universes behind it. Such a situation allows every possible action to play out, with different historical timelines taking place in different parallel universes. But this branching also takes place at the quantum level with some caused by minute changes within a single particle. Imagine if you had created a parallel universe gateway, and the universe you traveled to turned out to be entirely identical to your own, save for a single particle of cat food stuck to the cardigan of some crazy Belgian lady in a position one nanometer lower than usual. What a bummer. However, Everett didn't come up with the many worlds theory to spark off an existential crisis. He did so because it answers some important questions in quantum physics. The quantum level is the smallest level science knows of, at the moment, and studies into quantum physics have resulted in some unusual findings which we cannot explain. For example, quantum particles have been seen to shapeshift, and they are said to exist in all possible states at once until we observe them, at which point they choose a state completely at random. But Everett's Many Worlds concludes that when you measure something on a quantum level, this causes a split in the universe and that every possible state comes into existence in new, separate realities created just for this purpose. For a simpler explanation, imagine being asked if you wanted soup or salad for starters. Being asked causes your reality to split into two realities, one where you had soup and one where you had salad. In the many worlds theory, both realities exist, therefore there was never any choice to be made at all. This leads us to believe that there are forces in the universe operating on a deeper level than we're currently aware of. Another theory seeks to explain what these forces are. And this theory offers more proof for the existence of parallel universes. Number 2. String Theory String theory tells us that all matter and all forces have strings which dangle down to a level below the quantum level. These strings eventually form quantum particles, electrons, atoms, and cells with their destiny determined by vibrations on the strings. And this action takes place across 11 different dimensions. Ugh, my head hurts again. Let's just say that string theory imagines that everything in the universe is a seed, gravity, cat food, titanium, and dark matter. They all start as blank seeds. Then the seed puts roots down into the ground, at which point a magic underground space mole starts playing the roots like a harp, and the tune he plays determines what that seed turns into. A jaunty little ditty might create gravity, and a melancholy tune could result in the formation of gold. But what's this got to do with parallel universes? 
String theory claims that the strings of all matter and forces interact on the subquantum level, and that this interaction causes a split, leading to parallel universes each and every time. It also asserts that each universe is a bubble sat along other parallel universes, and that these separate bubbles often come into contact with each other. String theory says that gravity can flow between these two universes at the point of contact, and that strange things may happen when this occurs. A large contact might cause a new Big Bang, and a small one may just result in each universe's matter behaving in a bizarre way. Hmm, I guess we should look out for that. And at number one, the cold spot. The cold spot refers to a region of space in the radiation left over from our universe's formation, which is noticeably cooler than anywhere else. The patch was detected in 2004 by NASA's WMAP satellite, but until recently, nobody could explain why such a cold area might have formed. However, a study released just recently by a team at Durham University may have cracked it as it concludes that the cold spot formed when our universe collided with one of trillions of its parallel twins. The cold spot is 3 billion light-years away, and 1.8 billion light-years across. But it contains 20% less matter than it should, and is actually comprised of lots of small voids clustered together, rather than being one giant space hole. The Durham team believes that this cluster of voids, also known as a Kardashian, was caused by a universal pileup, which took place as our universe formed, with the energy forced from this region one of many such collisions taking place across different dimensions of space-time. This cosmic fender bender could be the cause of other famous cold spots, such as the Boötes void. But the Durham team has stressed that further investigation is necessary if we are to confirm their incredible theory. Nevertheless, in the future, we may look back at this discovery as the moment when the existence of the multiverse was confirmed, beating Half-Life 3 to the punch by approximately four millennia. But in another parallel universe, Half-Life 3 was confirmed this morning, and in another it came out in 300 BC. Also, if parallel universes do exist, then time travel should be possible. Your life is an illusion, and it may be impossible to ever know why our universe exists as it does. These are just some of the many bizarre implications of parallel universes which we've explored in our bonus video, The Strange Reality of the Multiverse, which you can watch on our Patreon page at patreon.com forward slash strange mysteries. For a $2 a month pledge, which you can cancel at any time, you'll get to watch this, and indeed, all of our bonus content, which goes deeper and darker into every topic than YouTube allows. If you don't want to donate, then it's cool, we still love you, and we'll continue to provide the best content we can under YouTube's restrictions, as you'll see if you watch our recent video on quantum immortality why you may be immortal.